Hi, this is Landon Bunderson, Chief Science Officer of AquaYield. I'm here to tell you today about our Bex Practical Farm Research results from 2022. Bex Practical Farm Research conducts hundreds of trials each year on new products to evaluate their use on broad acreage. In this presentation, we'll look at data from AquaYield products Nano Pro, Nano N Plus, and Nano K. In this first study, we're looking at data from three sites, Kentucky, Illinois, and Iowa. This was a comparison of a starter with 60 units of UAN and Nano N Plus with that 60 units of UAN. As you can see, there were about two and a half additional bushels added per acre. With corn at $6.11, that ROI is $9.05. If we drill in a second and look at the Iowa site specifically, in this case, there was an addition of three bushels to the acre, and the ROI was $11.50. Switching over to soybeans and Nano Pro, this study was conducted at seven sites. Nano Pro was added to a standard two quart VersaMax foliar application at V4. The addition of Nano Pro added roughly one bushel to the acre, with soybeans at $13.76 a bushel. That's a $9.48 return on investment. Here's another foliar study with NanoPro on soybeans. Seven states. NanoPro was added to the standard 5-ounce Lucento and Mustang Max at R3. Little over bushel and a half added per acre. Again, with soybeans at $13.76 a bushel, that's a $20.48 return on investment. Here's an Indiana fungicide additive study. Nano-K was added to the standard 5-ounce Lucento foliar application, and that resulted in an additional 3 bushels to the acre, and the return on investment was $35.60. Here's Nano-K at the Delta PFR site. The addition of 4 ounces of Nano-K to the standard 8-ounce Revitec fungicide at R3 added about a bushel and a half per acre, and the return on investment was $14.96. At the bottom of this slide, you can see the imagery with and without the Nano K. Definitely a lot more green in that Nano K treatment. That was a quick overview of the 2022 Practical Farm Research Trials using AquaYield products. If you'd like to learn more about AquaYield, go to AquaYield.com.